Three new Clash games have just been announced. I don't know what we did to deserve this gift, this treat, but I for one am not complaining. So let's have a look at this trailer right now. Today, for the first time ever, we are revealing three brand new games set in the Clash. Three! Ooh. Okay, the middle one looks amazing already. Hello, I'm Drew, the community What was the middle one? Hello, Drew. Hello, Darian. And I'm Seth. I've been a game designer. Hello, Seth from Street Fighter V. <laughs> and today, we're pulling back the curtain here at Supercell to show you not one, not two, but three new Clash Love the choreography. Three! With these new projects, we want to expand the Clash universe. Hello, Drew. Hello, Drew's beard. Hello, Drew's purple hat. But this is the first time in Supercell history... We've Hello, Seth from Street Fighter V. ...in this early, <laughs> early stage of development. So... So why are they sharing them so early in development? Are they desperate or like power hungry or just so kind right now? Clash.com now, nah, I'm alright. YouTube is enough. Enough. Clash Quest. Okay. So what, it's like an RPG? Like what? Shining Force? If anybody remembers that. Final Fantasy, old school turn based. That type of game, is it? Let's see. Hello, Toko. Hi, I'm Jimmy. Hello, Jimmy. Shout out Helsinki. Shout out Finland. I love my tactics. Trident. Who are those characters? Got some Trident weapons. You'd expect that. You'd hope for that. You've got to be consistent. To oh, they're hitting, hitting the walls. So they have walls like in Clash Clans. I can already see the giant is OP. You run out of troops, you die, okay, or lose the match. You get more units in your army. You get, you get more units in your army. So you yeah. It's part of the addictive nature of the, these types of games, right? So I bet you get bomber very quickly. Mega Knight or Mini Knight. Oh, you can combo! Five type. Okay, this is going to be insane. So you're going to set up your combos and then unleash them at once. I uh, set up set up your tactics. I like so far. My type of game. Actually, this might overtake Clash Royale if they're not too uh, careful. Bosses. That's true. Bosses are new. Oh, did you see that grid? When he was setting up his fire, so there's okay. It really is like RPG turn based. Each item triggers a bit differently. So items. One hundred percent more damage. So for example, Prince has an uh, item that does area damage when you have more than five Ooh. pieces. You try to make big combos, uh, activate your items in a smart way to uh, defeat the enemies. Okay, the items look a bit confusing at the moment. I'm sure so it makes sense. Ooh, Dragon Boss. I have no idea they are working on these games. Clearly a Clash game. You got that right. That feeling of frustration sometimes when you know that you should have made, maybe done a different move. We have a good mix of familiar of the Clash brand as well as some bringing something fresh into the Clash brand as well. I'm most excited to actually get this game into the hands of players and see their reactions and response. I bet I you are, Jimmy. Who have previously played Clash of Clans and Clash Royale are going to be playing this game, but uh, hopefully some people who haven't played those games were introducing the uh, Clash Royale. I, I see well. that this could expand their market. Different ways and, and since it's turn based, this game can be expanded. So, exploring those and seeing the player feedback uh, would be really, really interesting. So, release it now, then put your money where your mouth is. Re release it now, then so if you can't wait. <laughs>
Now, if you want to stay up to date on the development of this game, make sure you visit Clash.com. Again, YouTube is enough, sorry. No, I might check it afterwards. So I can update. I'll check it for you guys. We have spent the last couple of years hiring new positions and staffing up brand new game teams in our studio, Supercell Shanghai. Supercell! Shout out Supercell. They've come from nowhere, seemingly. It's took over. Hello, everyone. I'm Vlad from Supercell Shanghai. We'll What's up, Vlad? What? She's walking through a map. So first up, what? Fang, the game lead and game designer on the Clash Mini team. Okay, Clash Mini. Okay, this is another one. So what is this? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm Fan from Clash Mini. The endless fighting is not only happening what? in villages. Is this for kids? Arenas, what is this? You could say all of them are for kids, actually. In the format of a board game within Clash. And for adults. Players will be competing for intelligence and strategy against each other using miniatures. This is where the name Clash Mini came from. In Clash Mini, players place their minis at the same time. Okay, the players place, place their minis at the same time. what comments the combat automatically. Oh! We wanted the game to be the most accessible and life hugging strategy. Oh, this is very intended interesting. To be easy to play, but still have lots of depth. On the gameplay side, we are trying to make a casual strategy game that everyone can play. So we decided to focus. So you obviously don't know where your opponents are putting their characters, I assume. Control, like Clash Royale or Clash of Clans. Is that similar to like Battleship As or something? Player, you sunk my Battle Clash of Clan Clash character. <laughs> Minis themselves are incredibly cute and uniquely fitting to the world. Imagine Ooh, your favorite Grand characters Wizard. from Clash sitting down at the mini table and dueling with the miniature versions of those around them. The world feels familiar, yet the cuteness of minis could be very deceiving as well. Some of them are a true challenge that you need to overcome in each round. And now, let's talk about our second game, Okay, yeah, this other game looks... I think this has got to be the best one. It looks like it. Look! It's free roaming. We wanted a game like this. We wanted a game like this. We wanted a game. <laughs> you heard me. Game name for Clash Heroes. As the name suggests, Clash Heroes is a game where you assemble... Clash Heroes. ...diverse characters and set out on a journey through the world of Clash. Oh, come on. This looks too good. You play a variety of adventures. Some fight sides... This looks too good. Others more epic. Like Look at maybe when you encounter what? a goblin giant or a golem for the first time. What a massive goblin! Come on, this looks too good. Bring this out now, maybe some new so I can taste it or what they can do. and smell it but and hear it. New characters. Look, throwing power, bombs at people. To offer you a compelling gameplay what balloon? This is and literally the game, game that we've all wanted. We also want to give you the space to customize how you play. We actually really how do you customize? Oh, what is Gavin? What is that? Ways you will play these characters, especially when playing together with your friends. Or is that just someone's the name of the legend. user? Clash Heroes is made with Unreal Engine, so this is quite frankly a very different, a new way. Unreal Engine. Okay. There's a lot for us to learn on this project, and I want to emphasize Literally that different game. still quite early. This is going to be... Oh my goodness. This concludes the Shanghai Studio Update. Back to you, Helsinki. How good do those games look? Super cool. We have had so much fun... Is there any point in playing any other games right now? And remember, we're developing these games because of you. This wouldn't be possible without the millions of Clash players That's and true. content creators around the world. That's so true. So much for supporting we do Clash. keep um, these, these games, games uh, popular, don't we? we but they are I'm good. I genuinely like these games. I've started playing Brawl Stars recently as well. This is just a reminder that these games are in very early stages of development. That means so they're going to be even better. Things are likely to change. Clash of Clans and Clash Royale will not be affected by the development of these good. games. We also have a bunch of other games in development at Supercell, and not all of them will be set in the Clash universe. That's right. Mm. There's always tons of stuff. They had to uh, expand the universe at some point from the universe. Clash games we've revealed today, 
make sure to go to clash.com what, what was your favorite that you saw i mean for me it has to be the third one was it clash heroes about the clash games and development. the first one was clash quest and clash mini we will see you next time okay clash quest yeah. seems to be right up my street i love turn-based battles i love turn-based battles but having said that i do like free roaming as well and the third one clash heroes got to remember these names that looked very interesting as well. That looked like a sort of game that um, it takes longer to finish a round. You know, not exactly like League of Legends, like, you know, 20 minute matches, 40 minute matches, but it looks like it's more along those lines. And if it's not, Supercell, listen, you should make it more along those lines. You know, make a game like League of Legends, like Dota, etc., but with Clash characters, a Clash universe. You can then expand that winning concept already to the millions, if not billions, I don't know, but millions of Clash Supercell players already. So I, I think that's the way the Clash Heroes is going, but who knows? If, if not, they should make it like that. Clash Quest is just going to be straight to the point, turn-based, like Final Fantasy old school games, Shining Force old, old school games, um, you know, turn-based. Oh, but the difference is that it's turn-based, but there's also combos. Aha, uh -huh. so the combos are cool. Clash Quest. Clash Mini, you have to look more about Clash Mini. Look um, look at the info a bit more because it was a little bit confusing. I mean, they only showed it like, what, 20 seconds? That's how early that was in development. But it looks like you set your characters, your opponent sets their characters in, and the, your opponents, I guess, go in a certain direction and you don't know where your opponents are going to go. So they, they might clash, in quotes, um, with the other player or not. Like, do they, ch can they change direction i don't know we'll see we'll see but well i'm i'm gassed anyway i'm excited and i've just now got into recently got into brawl stars as well so i'm really late on brawl stars but stay tuned for more content on that i have made a video but it's not out yet it's still processing but yeah cool thank you for enjoying this experience with me like shout out to supercell as well shout out to um shanghai supercell helsinki um the helsinki branch as well shout out to everybody and uh, most importantly, guess what? Guess what's most important here? Take care, have a wonderful evening, and be good to yourself. Much peace to you.